Have you ever heard of a man called Zhang Tian? Well, not many have, but he was actually a man who changed the history of the country. Well, when Chang'an City was the capital of China during the Han dynasties, Zhang Tian set out on the Silk Road on a mission to explore unknown places and promote Chinese culture. Not only did he do a great job representing China to the world, but he also brought back a lot of new culture from other places that no one had known about. Along his journey, he went to a lot of different places along the Silk Road, and we recently found out over the last few years, 22 sites on the Silk Road have applied to be on the World Cultural Heritage List. Well, recently, seven of the 22 were inducted all belong to Shanxi Province. They include the Weiyang Palace Ruins, the Tomb of Zhang Tian, the Daming Palace Ruins, Da Yan Ta, Xiao Yan Ta, the Xinjiao Temple, and the Grottoes in Da Fu Temple. So today, with the help of CNOS.com, we will visit our first station along the Silk Road, the Da Fu Temple in Bin County, to see the first Buddhist temple along the Silk Road. Da Fu Temple was built during the Tang Dynasty by Emperor Taizong, which explains why this was the largest temple and the most exquisite during that period. But why did the emperor build such a large temple, and why did he put more than 1,000 Buddha statues inside? Well, according to Chinese history, there was a big battle in a place called Tianxueyuan, which was very near this temple. And during this battle, the emperor lost 100,000 warriors. So it is said that he put these Buddhas in this temple to make sure all their souls would be sent to Elysium. The whole temple consists of three main parts. The Da Fu Grottoes, the Thousand Buddha Cave, and the Luo Han Cave. Inside the Dao Fu Grottoes, you will see the statue of Amitabha sitting on the Lotus Throne. This statue is over 20 meters tall and is the largest Buddha statue in Shanxi Province. On either side of this Buddha, you'll see two statues of Pusa, and these two Buddhas are 17.6 meters tall. Located to the east of the Dao Fu Grottoes are the Thousand Buddha Caves, and inside you will find 669 different Buddhas that sit in 175 different shrines. On the west side of the Da Fu Grottoes is the Luo Han Cave. Now, this place is well known for being home to more than 300 pieces of Jing Bian paintings, which are paintings that show the development of Buddhism in China. Right guys, remember that name, Da Fu Temple. It's only our first stop on the Silk Road, so stay tuned to future episodes where we will talk more about other routes on this famous road. 